To check a framing square for accuracy, we need a piece of wood with one straight edge and deep enough that the long blade will hang down it. Put the short arm on the edge and then draw a line down the long arm. Turn it around, putting the short arm again on top of the wood and hold the edge against the line. The line should match it perfectly up and down. If it doesn't, figure out if the square needs to be brought in or out. We're actually going to move this leg, but you still need to know if it's going to have to be closed or opened up. A framing square that's actually 90 degrees will match the line all the way down when you turn it around. If it doesn't, the direction that the line is off, measure at the bottom of it, that's where you'll see the greatest error, will tell you which way you need to correct the square. To make corrections on a framing square, we use a center punch to make little divots along the edge of the short arm. That's the narrowest one, there's less material to work. If we want to open the frame up, we make them along the inside edge. If we want to close the frame up, we make them along the outside edge, but do them both right near the corner here. Start out making two or three divots and go back to the board, draw another line and check, and pro check your progress. You can only make a correction of a, a maximum of about a sixteenth of an inch, but that's generally all you need. You very seldom see a framing square that's out by more than that. If it is, you just need a new one.